Hi, I'm Jody Aramo. I represent Summit College Funding in Loveland. Our company specializes in helping families pay less for college. The number one way that we do that is we educate families about the financial aid process. So that's what our presentation is about tonight. Um, number one, you may have heard about the changes in FAFSA. Um, that's the free application for federal student aid. There are a lot of changes to that process in 2016 that affect not only seniors, but also juniors and sophomores and even freshmen. So we're gonna talk about those changes tonight too. Um, if you missed it, um, you will absolutely want to maybe try to catch our, our public workshop that we do in our office in Loveland the first Tuesday of every month. You can reach out to your guidance office if you want information on how to do that. One of the main things that people are not aware of is how school selection um, plays into what they will ultimately pay for college. And by that, I mean a couple of different things. Number one, most students today go about the school selection process backwards. They choose a school first, then a major, then a career. That's actually backwards. What you want to do is choose a career first. There are a lot of tools available to students now to help them do that. Um, once you've done that, choose a major that will get you to that career. And then once you've done that, choose a school that's very well respected in that major. So only once um, the student has identified what schools might work for them, then the family needs to come in and say, how are we gonna pay for it? How much does it cost? One of the very important um, concepts is that you need to not look at sticker price, but net price. There's a huge difference, and you wanna make sure that you're going about the school selection process in the right way.